They do everything right, everything by the book, and it doesn't go our way. You know, and that's difficult to deal with. Very difficult. First responders devastated after working tirelessly to save two young boys found in a pond in Montgomery County last night. Sadly, those boys did not survive. A third child did make it after it appears those three kids wandered away from their home. It is simply heartbreaking. Five children have drowned in the Houston area in just the last week. The latest happened last night in a rural area between Conroe and New Caney. Jason Miles is live at the fire station that responded to the call. Very tragic, Jason. Yeah, to say the least, Lynn, you may recall one week ago today, I was down at Sylvan Beach in LaPorte covering the drowning deaths of three young siblings. I'm told the two boys in this case were not brothers, but were related. A small pond off a small country road, site of an immense tragedy for the surrounding community. It breaks my heart. Neighbor Tina Terry has grandchildren she never lets out of her sight. As a grandmother, you know, I cried last night. You know, I watched them do CPR and, and they couldn't save them, you know, and I've been crying all day. The Montgomery County Sheriff's Office says two boys, ages three and four, drowned in the pond after it appears they wandered away from home with a third child who survived. This is video from the scene last night where deputies and emergency personnel initially responded to a report that the kids were missing. Take a look. You can see the first responders footprints here in the pond. I'm told one child's body was found immediately. The second at the bottom of a drop off in the middle of the pond. I've been doing this for close to 40 years and it doesn't get any easier. Caney Creek Fire and Rescue Chief Raymond Flannelly told me crews did everything they could to try and save the children. They focused on the pond after a firefighter noticed bubbles on the water and small footprints in the mud. There's been a ton of drownings in the greater Houston area this summer. And um, the sad part is it's all preventable, you know, just with a few safeguards. A neighbor pointed me to a home not far from the pond where at least one of the children lived, but someone there said the family My heart breaks for the parents. is too shaken up to talk. And again, the Montgomery County Sheriff's Office is still investigating these drownings and the circumstances that may have led up to these boys wandering away from home. The third boy who survived was treated for some lacerations at a hospital over in the woodlands. Guys, three and four years old, really so sad. And we cannot stress enough, folks, the importance of water safety and keeping an eye on your kids. 71 children have drowned in Texas this year. Harris County has the most with 13 drownings. That includes the three siblings who drowned in LaPorte a week ago. Water safety can save lives. We have put together information on how to protect your kids around water. Just go to our website, khou.com.